Hey guys, welcome to another episode of All Aboard, uh, endorsed by Board Sock. Food supplies are low, your friends are getting angsty, and the world is infested by the undead. Everything is looking pretty dire, and you're pretty sure someone in the colony is working against you. You're faced with one question. Will you be able to survive in the dead of winter? Ooh. <laughs> right, just a heads up for anyone that's played this game, and otherwise we've done all the setup. It's just about doing it now. We'll explain rules as they go. Uh, right, so our first thing we do is we're all gonna roll our dice to see what see what happens. Ooh. Ooh. The higher numbers, the better. Three. So put them all in the unused action dice bit of your sheet. Okay. Did we put the exact same roll? Yeah, we did. That was weird. <laughs> <laughs> right, now Connie takes a crossroads okay. card because Luke is our starting player. Uh -huh. Right. So she's got her, have you, have you got an idea of what you need to keep track of in the yes. italics? Cool. Mm -hmm. Luke, what do you want? Oh, wait, we've got to reveal our crisis of the, the, the week. Mm -hmm. oh. So we've got to get more food, because we're playing, we're playing the too many mouse scenario, which means there's a lot of, a lot of Hungry people, people starving people, yeah. that aren't doing much, and we have to feed them. Awesome. So our crisis is, hold this up, we have to get four food, in order to not have bad things happen. Okay. We do get a bonus, however, oh, do you want? <laughs> we do get a bonus if we have two extra food added in. So if we make six rather than four, okay. Okay. I wouldn't recommend it because we obviously need to focus on feeding people as well. Okay. So if we get more food left over, maybe, but then obviously we'll still cool. have to feed everyone next week. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Luke, what is your, what is your, what do you want to do? Well, if we're needing food, then show the grocery store it's a place to be. Uh, yeah, however, Andrew, my, my farmer, my farmer dude, oh, is pretty set up in searching really well at the grocery store. He gets to take two cards when he's searching rather than one. So would you rather we leave that one for you? Well, I don't mind. It's just if we have two people at the grocery store, next week two zombies will show up. Oh, so I was saying, like, is, is, yeah, so each one is a week, each round of players. Makes sense. Uh, then in that case, I will go to, where's the second most food? Oh, actually, school. Do you go to school? You can yeah. go to the school. Yeah. Yeah. Do you have fuel? Do you have fuel you'd like to pay, play to get there, or would you, do you not have any fuel? I do not have any fuel. Then you'll have to roll for exposure to get there. I see. I don't think I have any fuel. I don't. You'll have to roll for exposure. Those uh, are my big dice. red dice. Big, big red dice. Got it. Okay, so you take a frostbite wound. Mm -hmm. Next week, this go. Who are you moving? Um, I'll you? move Olivia Brown. Okay. But can I use her ability to? Yeah, hold on, put it on her first. Okay. And then, what is your ability, Luke? Uh, it's, blue, it's the blue one, you've got to change it over, you've got a frostbite. Nice. Uh, so once per round, you may remove any type of wound token from a survivor that shares a location with Olivia. Olivia may use this ability on herself. Show it to the camera. She's the doctor. Makes sense. <laughs> so are you going to use that? To I am going to use that. The frostbite is gone. Lovely. Like she that. got rid of that because she was like, I'm not cold. <laughs> <laughs> Just rubbed her hands. She was like, I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so where's Olivia? Olivia is uh, here. So she's going to come to the school. She's now chilling out over here. There she is at the school, living her best life. <laughs> <laughs> I support what her. What do you want to do now that you're at the school? Um, can I draw a card? Uh, what is your search on Olivia? Uh, three. So Oops. you have to play a dice of three or higher. You're on the wrong side. On the right side, yeah. Oh, okay. You have to play a dice of three or higher to search, so that one can't be used to search. Oh, so it'd have to. Ah, okay. So, so you play a five to yeah. search, and you get this card. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. That's that's that. Do you want to do anything else? Can I you, use you, this? You get to use all your dice. Do you, where are you putting it? Uh, it's a so it's a weapon. Okay. So to equip that, do I just? You place it on a character. Then I'll equip her with that. So, Olivia's got a baseball bat, everyone. Do you want to show everyone what the baseball bat does? Yeah. So, once per round, when performing an attack with the survivor, you may kill two zombies instead of one. There you go. Great. So she gets to kill two. Baron. Excellent. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, right, you've got two other dice you can use. Basically, there are a few things you can do that don't need values. You can make barricades with any dice you have, and you can clean the waste with any dice you have. What does cleaning waste do? That would be the waste pile. But oh, okay. have nothing in it, so there's no point in cleaning it, because it's <laughs> empty. What's, yeah. the, what's the use in um, 
attracting zombies. So you would you would use that to attract two zombies from another location. Uh, to your, I see. So you could drag two away from the colony to the school. I see. Uh, what I'll do is I'll, I'll put up a barricade. You want to put a barricade up. So you spend one of your dice. I would recommend spending the one because that can't be used for much else. Mm -hmm. And then now I'll do it that way. Cool. It would be easier to keep track of. Yeah, that's true. Right. Uh, what else? You've got one more t thing you can do. You could search again if you wanted. Yeah, might as well. You can get another thing from the school. There you go. Interesting. Do you have anything you can contribute to the crisis or the food supply? Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll contribute to the crisis. You could put one. I don't have food. to say what it is. Well, it's food, but it I don't. It is food, but you don't. Why would you say you don't have to say what it is? Now I don't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> right, that's your turn done. So oh. that. That crossroads card goes in here. That is genuinely food, and I don't want to make out that for myself <laughs> all over really early. Like, Connie, have a look. it's your turn. That means Luke, Exciting. you take a crossroads. <laughs> Get a read of the italics, figure out what it does. Um, yep, so that's instantly already. Is it happening? If a survivor of the player controls is at the colonel. Okay, read okay. it out. Um, it... I need everybody at the gate right now. There's a flatbed that just pulled up, loaded with refugees. Every player with one or more survivors at the colony must vote with a thumbs up or down. The option with the most votes takes so effect. So we all have to vote on that. And you don't, I don't tell you what the results of the, the thumbs up option and the thumbs down option are. Well, you tell us what they are, but you don't tell us what happens as a result. What, so op is option one just we vote to let them Oh, so, so you want to hear like the, the flavour We want to know what we're voting for. Okay. <laughs> um, so thumbs up is we don't have much but if your people are willing to pull their own weight we can give you a home for the winter at least after that you're on your own the thumbs down option I'm sorry we just can't take any more you're going to have to keep moving okay, okay. okay. should we do we want to talk about this or should we just should, should we just what, 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 I don't think we need these people I personally. don't think so either <laughs> I don't think so we've got a lot of people well, we don't need any more we're no. going to be starving otherwise. but isn't that the right thing to do should no. we be looking after these you know what these? the consequences is like I don't <laughs> that's me <laughs> yeah. now I was reading through them then and it doesn't seem like there's right well. 3, 2, 1 and on 1 we vote ok, okay. 3, 2, 1 on a tie I don't know what it is on a tie we let them in <laughs> I think it depends on who has the highest influence on the first player token so I think we do it because we're letting them in. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let them in. So. <laughs> I just want to see what happens. Maybe. Each player draws one survivor from the survivor deck and adds it to their following. Each player also adds one helpless survivor to the colony. So we get four more people in the colony. Mm -hmm. I, was just, uh, you, I can just pop them down. Yeah, and then we all get a new person. Okay. So this is my person. It's Arthur Thurston, the principal. He's here. Mm -hmm. Ooh. And then you have this person. I've got Gabriel Diaz, the fireman. <laughs> 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 Morale goes straight up. Then you have oh, this he's dead good, this kid. <laughs> I have Greybeard, the pirate. <laughs> <laughs> Why do we have a fireman? Why did these all show up on a flatbed? Why was the fireman, a pirate, and a principal together? <laughs> like, can we Here's come your in? one. And to make up the group, Brandon Kane, the janitor, which makes sense. He worked at the school. The school. We saw you. We saw you there. Saw <laughs> and then we oh, met yeah. our pirate friend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And our firemen. Oh, done. Let me get them all out of this box. There they are. Look at They're them. so lovely. Look at our gang of men to join us. Yes. Uh, I can't. Read. <laughs> Greybeard looks so distrustful. Like, so oh currently, God, based off our colony size, we need one, okay. two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, start. eleven food. <laughs> 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 you, you two asked for this. <laughs> <laughs> look at all these. Look at these. Keep them out. That's what I say. <laughs> 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 right. Okay. So it's that's you that, voted for a that hard dead now? winter. Was there anything else or was that it? Uh, that was it. Okay, and then we put that crossroads in the discard. Oh, do we need to show this? Or did he show it? Cool. Now, Connie, you get to do the rest of your turn. Okay. So, Talia is going to look at the top two crisis cards. I think. Uh, she wants to, she so she gets to see the next two. She gets to two. see the next two and put them back in any order. Do you want to show the card to the camera so everyone knows that's what Talia does? She's 
she's got a fortune teller. She's the, she can see what's going to happen. She can. So you she get says, to see these two and realign what one you want to come first. And you can you can tell us vaguely. I think you're allowed to like hint at what they are. I think you have yeah. to. Yeah, it's two you words. Say two, I can say two words. words. To explain what's coming. Oh, also, at the end of this round, we'll all get an extra dice. Just for okay. me to do that. Because we have new people, which means more dice. Lovely. Okay, so what are your two words, Connie? Um, I'm going to put them back okay. first. I'm just remembering what order. <laughs> okay, so. Put them, you, no, this is the top, so just you have to put... Oh, we, I can put it back in any order. Oh, wait, what does it say? Um... Once per round, you may look at the top two cards of the crisis deck and place them back in any order. Oh. I think it's between the two. Then you may say exactly two. two words. Oh, okay. So you have to just reach. So you can choose which one you put on first and which one you put on so second. So which one you want to delay and which one you yeah. want to... But you could easily keep using this ability each turn to delay one of them because you can keep putting it behind another yeah. one. Yeah. 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 Cool. <laughs> right. Hmm. What do you want to do now, Connie? Can we get the two words? Fuel. Oh. Bad. Feel bad. <laughs> um, <laughs> Great. <laughs> I know everything. Um, now. It's all clear to me. Does that mean getting fuel is bad? No, I mean they're two, se <laughs> I mean they're two separate incidents. Like, um, we need to get fuel um, and then something bad's going to happen. Right. I'm going, Talia is going to go to the gas station. She's gonna, do you have fuel or are you just going to walk there? Um, I've got fuel. So you can play the fuel in the waste pile and then you won't have to roll for exposure. Cool. Place it face up, this one. Cool. In it goes. Now we move Talia to the gas station and she doesn't have to roll for the exposure because she drove. Mm -hmm. Right, and then I'm going to search. So you're so. Gonna search for one. Yep. You need to take one card off the deck. Okie okay, dokie. I have a lot of food, by the way, so I'll be able to That's sort fine. some stuff out. Cool. Just a heads up, everyone. That's fine. Oh, also, can you keep the dagger with loot because that doesn't move until the end of the round. It's just That's to keep track of because first player will come to me next. I see. Time. Cool. That's fine. So whoever finishes um, starts so next. Time. Oh, okay, cool. I got you. Okay, and then I'm going to search again. You're going to search another time, get another card. Cool. I would also advise to make life easier because we also count us as people that we need to feed. Yeah. Maybe getting, I know Bev is good in the colony. Yeah. But it might be good to get Greybeard out. Yeah, that's true. I think I might move him. Because he will be less food if he gets out. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to send all of mine out because they're all better outside of the colony. Yeah, Bev is going to stay. Um, Bev needs to protect her children. I'm We're going just going to assume every helpless survivor is Bev's child. Um, yeah. <laughs> Even or the ones we just collected. Exactly. Well, they're, they're her children now. <laughs> like, She's adopted them. Right, so Greybeard is going to go to... Oh, she's looking at a secret objective because there is a traitor here. Greybeard is going to go to... The police station. Mm. Have you got fuel um, or are you going to let him just walk? I might just let him walk. Fair. <laughs> Off he goes. Do I, I need to roll, roll for the exposure? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just rolled a bite, which means Greybeard got to the police station. And he died. And then he died. So oh, no, he was the, the one pirate. I liked least. <laughs> <laughs> so we all, as a result, lose a morale. Our morale was at seven. Now it's at six. If we hit zero, RIP Greybeard. If we hit zero, we lose. Mm. So Greybeard is going to go in our graveyard. I'll make a little graveyard over here. Lie Thank him you. down. Yeah, it seems fitting. There we go. Is. I'm very sad. Lost but never forgotten. <laughs> <laughs> we I'm barely pirate. knew you. Greybeard <laughs> <You> just <laughs> showed up. <laughs> <laughs> you showed up on this truck, wandered out, and we never saw you again. <laughs> Um, exactly. He was so quite has, useless. So next yeah. round, you'll keep your dice. We'll all get an extra dice because now you only. You That's fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> you go for that pirate look. You know, so, <laughs> can so I also? Kind of <laughs> can I put something in the colony? Uh, to the crisis. To the crisis. Yeah, you put it face down and you say you announce what it is. But obviously. I mean, obviously. <laughs> I mean, I think you don't have to announce it. You can just put it down. Yeah. Mm. But I think if you're putting more in, you have to announce that you're putting more than one in. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Oh, so can you just put loads in? You can put more than um, one card in. Oh, sick. And then... Am I, I able to we'll erect a right. barricade, or do I have to roll for that? No, you can just play that five, fifth die, that dice of a five. To, you don't need a value to make it. Okay. Technically, we benefited from losing Greybeard. 
Yeah. Because now we have one, one less, less person, person to be. <laughs> <laughs> Too many mouths. <laughs> <laughs> Please, no. in the name. Yeah. Because of me and you, you have to. <laughs> yeah, I like you. We need to get them out. You asked. You let them in. <laughs> me and Connie wanted them out. I know. This never would have happened if you'd listened to us. I'm just saying. <laughs> right, it's Paige's turn yeah. now. Yes, yeah, so I get a card for you. Okay, so what I want to do is I, um, I once per round with Loretta Clay for Cook. I can put two food tokens into the colony. Can I do that? Uh, does it need a dice? Over four. So you and need I a dice of four. four or higher. All of my dice are four and higher. So you're gonna make a food. Yeah. What are you? How many are you making? Two. So can you put two of the food tokens? These in ones. The food supply. Yes, we got so food. <laughs> we're gonna feed everyone. <laughs> Sarcasm. Um, I don't think we're gonna food. feed everyone. <laughs> and then for my second one, I am gonna send Gabriel Diaz out. Um, you going to send Gabriel out? Where's he going? Gabriel Diaz. He is going to go to the grocery store. Okay, him and him and Andrew will chill out then. Yeah. We're both going. Okay, um, can, are you using fuel to get there? Um, do I have fuel? No, I don't have any. So Andrew's going to run the risk of dying. Not Andrew. Gabriel is going to run the risk of dying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, he was so good. <laughs> Gabriel has also been bitten on the way to him. <laughs> Within oh, the herd, no. get rid of them. <laughs> get rid of them. It's all the, the new. best of the herd. <laughs> so we've lost another morale, and morale is now at five. It's all the newbies oh, as well. Like, no. I mean, the people that have just got it. Like, why why did we let shot? them in? They're awful. <laughs> they better with the flatbed. <laughs> Incompetent, a lot of them. Okay, so that was a waste of that dice. Um, and then for my... What did you use that other dice? You don't need to use a dice to move, by the way. Oh, okay. Um, then I've got two. Edward White. Get these zombies here. That are in the ha- in the colony. Yeah. Can I fight them? You can. I I'm gonna have a fight. Are you gonna f- just a heads up? I'm not I'm not saying you don't. I'm just gonna give you an idea of the rules. If you roll an exposure dice and roll a bite, because there's more people, the bite will start spreading. So okay. if he dies, someone else will start dying as well. Do you know what I mean? We run the risk of like everyone starting uh, to just. Wait. So let me just check. They can't get in. The zombies. Yeah. They can't yet. When can they start so worrying? Oh, there's three people yeah. in an entrance and another one gets added into that entrance, then we'll oh, get Oh, no, 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 that's fine then. And I then thought, is it instant loss? Yeah. I thought we had to take him out. Oh, no, also remember that Bev can kill two pe- two zombies per round without rolling for exposure. She can just kill them. She can yes. get rid of them she to can protect just get rid her of babies. Them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Is, um, is, is that an instant loss if we get overrun? No, we lose a morale if someone dies. Oh, okay. So it's just, again, it's just the same thing. If one gets overrun, we Okay, well, I don't morale. have any fuel, but the only thing I can really do then is go out again. Uh, Edward does stuff good with medicine, doesn't he? He does. Can I can I make medicine? You could go to hospi- the hospital and get some medicine. Oh, I'll do that then. I'll go to the hospital with Edward and but get you, some medicine. You don't have fuel again, yeah, so, so off he goes. <laughs> Let's see if Edward die. dies on the way. Edward doesn't die, he just takes a hit. Okay. He got a little bit of a bump. Well, that's fine. He's off to the, he's off to the hospital. <laughs> so so uh, can you move uh, Edward okay. over the to best the place, hospital? It's the best place for him. What does he look like? He's the one that with the red one. jacket on. That one. Yeah. Uh, hospital. hospital is the yeah. you. There it is. And um, oh, I'm gonna have a, a cheeky search. search. He's gonna have a rummage. Can I? Uh, you need to spend a dice. Yeah. 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 Then you can see what it is, and okay. you get to put it in your. Sweet. Um. And um, can I do it again? Yeah, you can search again. Okay. Okay. I forgot about this, but you haven't done it. Sweet. So it's, fine. So it's the end. Is that the end of your turn? Yeah. I'm cool. Done. Your turn now. My turn now. You take this. Oh, I do. When does the crisis end? Just whenever we solve it. Uh, the crisis at the end of the round, we look at whether we've figured it, solved it or not. Okay. We count all the cards. That's it. Right. I'm about to throw about a bunch of food out. So I have a lot. Oh fuck! So my turn's done, isn't it? Uh. Can I? Since we're not playing totally seriously, should we allow it this one time? I mean, it's the first round. We'll allow it exactly. on the first so round. Yeah. Other than food. this, if people forget, then they forget. They forget, yeah. So how many food can I put in? As many as, as you many. Have. You can play as many cards as you want. There's no turn limit. There's no limit on that. I also okay. forgot to put food in, but that's, it's too far gone for me. Yours was yeah. far gone. <laughs> that's fair. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Just a heads up. Three food in. And are you going to play any more food to the supplier? Do you not have any more? Um... Food yeah, are you gonna? F- this is the crisis. This is feeding as well. Um, I just put all three in that one. Can I put them in food supply? Yeah, you can change them. Oh, okay. Um, then I'll put. 
I would keep that to four and then use the other food to feed us. And okay, put two more in there then. Have you played? Oh, it's one, just one. Just one. So you put that in this pile. Okay. Yeah, you have to do the counting number on oh, it. Oh, okay, It says okay, food okay, one okay. on it. So on food supply, you actually have to show it. You can't, you can't play You can't secretly <laughs> <so food. laughs> <Food supply. laughs> eat this junk. <laughs> so how many cards are here? Three? Yeah. No, there's four. Okay. So if everyone's... So technically, oh. have you? did you play two cards? I put, two, I put three food down. Should I take another one? How many? Wait. I put three in there, but then I moved one. And there's so four in total, because I put one in before. I, like, I put one in. Oh, oh so yeah. we've, we've got four, enough in there. You're yeah. not meant to look at them, technically. Oh, uh, sorry, that was my one. Then. That's okay. That is your, your one, to be fair. Yeah. So, yeah, so we don't need to put any more in there unless there's <coughs> a So I could put traitor. all of my food in the supply unless I don't trust one of you. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to put them all in the supply. Good. Okay. We get free food. Um, are, your, are your guys still in the corner? Yeah, I'm okay, still in the corner. Then. Things are gonna happen, okay. Morale around this place is at an all time low, Cassandra. I think <laughs> But imagine what hot showers and meals could do for everybody. Get us feeling human again. Sometimes I think we focus so much on the obvious necessities that we forget about the emotional ones, you know? <laughs> Play may collectively place three fuel cards in the waste pile without using their ability to raise morale by one. They don't. So we either put free fuel in, or, or we don't, or and nothing happens. Um, I don't have morale don't. back, but if we don't, nothing happens. Okay, so I don't have any fuel. I don't have any fuel, I just have medicine. No. Can you choose not to put it in? Yeah, you don't Okay, I know. Yeah, we, we, I don't have it's fuel, covered. so yeah. I can't. Okay. We good? We're just spinning it off. We're like, no, what? No. We don't get to have <laughs> fun. You know what? It's a hard world we live in now, and we oh, need to get used to it. Exactly. You can do it. Raymond and Gabriel are dead. They didn't die so we could have showers. <laughs> <laughs> right. My turn properly now. So both two of my characters get to use abilities at the school and another one gets to use their abilities at the grocery store. So all of my characters are good not in the colony. So as a result, I'm going to send them all elsewhere. Cool. I'm going to send Andrew to the grocery store. He's the one with the broom over there. The spade even, it's not a broom. Where is he? Spade. He's at the right yeah. back note, the one, yeah. yeah. Maybe run for exposure great. to see if he dies on the way. If he doesn't, he just gets frostbite. A little bit nippy. Which is... He's a chilly oh, boy. No. He's a chilly boy. He's cold, yeah. yeah. And then next turn, if I still have that frostbite, he gets another wound. Okay. You can't, if you get more than two, you're dead. Okay. okay. I can, I can... You could take one more. Okay. But you obviously don't get can another Can I heal one. myself? Yeah, if you use medicine, okay, but so. on your turn. How many cards are in the waste? We're allowed to count how many cards are in the waste pile. Yeah. Okay. Four, five, there's five. Okay. That means I'm gonna use a medicine, which means I get to remove any type of wound token from a survivor I control, or remove any type of wound type token from a survivor that shares a location. And I'll take care of... Yourself. <laughs> myself. Oh, they're here. Andrew is no longer chilly. He's okay. Oh, good. And then he's gonna search which as his special abal ability, ability. Abalata. <laughs> Once per term when performing a search at the grocery store, you may look at and keep one additional card. So he gets two instead of one. I'll put a food two in, which gives us two food. Yes. How many more food do we need? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. How much do we have in the supply? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Damn, okay. Four. So technically we're all fed. But Wait, I do we only Oh, because it's two for people, isn't it? Yeah. One for two. Yes, I see. So I might I still might take people out anyway, because if I take another people out we only need seven and then we have a food that carries over for next round. Yeah. Great. So it might just be easier if I get them out. My one problem though, Maria and Arthur, the principal and the teacher, are both really good at the school. But if we have three people in the school, that means three zombies show up. I can batter zombies. So oh, can well. Maria. Maria gets to kill one for three, for one and doesn't have to roll for exposure. Cool. So she just gets to murder things. Uh, you know what? We'll just send them. But my one worry is if I get bitten, Olivia will probably die as well. If you kill Olivia, I'll be gutted. <laughs> I like Olivia. Does she lose a bat then? Does the bat just disappear? The bat will get put back in the school. No. Because she died there. And, and someone will find it. Yeah. Hopefully. Along right. with a corpse. I'm going to send... Arthur first. Arthur's gonna go, he's the one with the torch, the old man. Okay. 
Now it happens, he makes it He was fine. fine, Arthur just had a Hello. lovely jog over. Hello, I'm here. And then I'll send Maria over as well. And she gets hurt. But... Which one's Maria? She's the one crouching on yeah. the rock. Yeah. But uh, however, I'm gonna play another medicine. I would've got rid of that injury for you next turn. But oh well, it's in there now. Mm, I haven't let go of it. <laughs> Olivia will sort you out. Cool, Olivia will patch Maria up, bless her. She's got out of my way, help me. <laughs> uh, and then I'm gonna have Arthur search once. Oh, that was a six, just a heads up. And then he's gonna take two. No, that's the wrong one. He gets to look at two, because Arthur has a very similar ability to but school. Andrew, but it's with the school instead. Nice. Because he's the principal, so he knows where he's looking. Uh. Ooh. So I just found a book called Beginner's Martial Arts. And when I equip it once per round, I do not roll for exposure when performing an attack with this survivor. So I basically get to teach people my, one of my people martial arts. <laughs> I'm probably gonna. Mm, I'll teach Art Andrew it because I think he's gonna be, he's gonna be on his own. So I try. I need him to be able to defend himself, and he also has a lower role anyway to get combat done. And then I'm gonna check the school one more time, or should I check school or grocery store for food? Or well, in general. Maybe grocery. Uh, wait, you're already in there. I'm at school and grocery store. I just get to search one of them. Which one should I search? Um, I'd go with grocery store because... Just being for more food. Yeah. So be ready yeah. for it when it happens. Not helpful. Still not helpful. Great. <laughs> Waste the time. Cool. That's the end of my turn, which means it's the end of our round. Wait, uh, wait we have to do this huge... Oh. So now we have to pay food. So one, two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight. Am I might no. Hold on. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Eight, There's fifteen people there, including these people. So yeah, eight food. 16. So you take eight food out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So all our food. All our food is gone, but we're fed. Mm -hmm. Then we have to check the waste. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The waste is not overflowing. So How many does it take to overflow? Ten. Okay, I'll uh, do some cleaning. Then we resolve the crisis. This is where I so I take this the pile that we contributed, mm -hmm. shuffle it up so that we don't know the order, so that no one knows, can follow it back and figure out who played what where. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so this could go wrong. This could be where our traitor reveals themselves. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. So we have one food, another food. Another food. And another food. Oh, we are not okay. starving today, friends. We succeeded with that crisis. Okay. So these go in a little discard over here. And then that crisis. So are those foods for the last round? Hmm? Do, the food, do those foods count for last round's food? No, they were just. So the crisis, crisis is completely isolated from the food supply. Okay. So it's nothing to do with feeding, which is annoying when you get a food one. Because you're yeah. like, well, now I have to waste food on yeah. the crisis as well as, yeah. So now we add zombies. So how much food oh did we add? Eight. 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 So we get, God, I have to, one, two, three, look at them all starting, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now you will see how that happens when it goes okay. round in a circle every time. Then we have one here, three here, School's getting a bit busy. We get one at the hospital. And we get one at the gas station. And then we check the main objective. We haven't finished it. The round track goes down by one. What was the main objective again? We have to survive. We have to Five. stay alive. Uh -huh. uh, now we move the round. Now we move the first player token. So now I start. Yep. Uh, and then. We reveal our new crisis because we're now in our start of our next turn. Our next one is fuel. It's almost like someone told us this. <laughs> <laughs> and then we roll our dice. Wait, new dice. Paige yeah. and I don't get new dice, do we? Cause no, because your people are dead. Our people are dead. <laughs> Me and Luke get an extra dice because of our new people. Love what? Okay. 
Friends right, of Greybeard no, hadn't been so shit. R.I.P. Greybeard, R.I.P. Gabriel, you were saw in there. Oh. Oh, shit. I didn't roll great. I rolled excellent. I lost the dice. <laughs> I. That's so sick. Cool. So, I new. Put up some barricades. You get this for me. Okay. <laughs> 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 and then you just get an idea of what it says. Okay. You got it? Well, don't say that. <laughs> it might happen. You never know. Okay. It probably won't. <laughs> <laughs> right. So I'm going to spend a one for Maria. Because as I think... I, did I show her? No. Once per round, you may kill zombie at one zombie at the school. Do not roll for exposure. So I'm going to pick her up. There she is. Good old Maria. She's the teacher. For some, for some reason means she knows how to kill things. <laughs> she is knowledgeable. So one of these zombies is gone. She doesn't even have to roll for it. Great. She dropped a book on its head. She was like hiding a bundle of <laughs> it and just pushed it down the <laughs> stairs. Do you need to take one out of. No, I killed one yeah. at the school. Oh, okay, that's fine. I, uh, I don't have anyone at the colony anymore, so I, that's uh, all on you guys. <laughs> okay, that's fine. That's fine. I, could, I can still contribute, I just can't see. Yeah. I can't fight anything there. Uh, and then. Oh no, no, I can fight. So can, oh, she can kill two per round. Um, just. Feels like it. Like right, I'm gonna use my two yeah, to search the school oh. with Arthur. Not good. <laughs> Where is fuel in this world? <laughs> to the gas station with me. <laughs> only at the gas station and only at the. Oh, there's some at the police station. I would go there if I thought that. Talia's planning on staying there for a while. I feel like you don't need to come just yet. Well, Talia's not there. You sent Greybeard and Greybeard died. No, I sent Greybeard to the police station. Talia's still at the gas station. Oh, I meant the police. I might go to the police <gasps> oh, station. Oh, I see. Oh, magical. But none of my characters benefit from being at the police station. I just yeah. want to go. <laughs> <laughs> that, sound, that sounds sus, but I want to go to the police station. Um, I'll just have Arthur search at the grocery store. Mm, wait. Well, I don't. I can't. Neither of these places have fuel, so I can't find fuel. But you can find food and medicine. In there, yeah, so I'm that's... just gonna keep looking for food. Right, I'm gonna equip Maria or Arthur. Who should I equip with this? I'm gonna equip Maria with rotting flesh. Nice. When spreading a bite effect, we ignore her. So when the bite is spreading, she doesn't, she can't, she, she can't get it. Okay. This is the card here. She's going to just carry some flesh around. <laughs> She's into that shit. <laughs> well, you know, everyone's got their king. So here's a shame. It's the apocalypse. Okay. And then I'll search at the, I'll search at the school. Right. Okay. Cool. I'm going to put some food in the waste. I can't clean it. Someone else clean the waste, please. How do you clean the waste? You use any dice. So it's like a barricade where you can use any value to okay. make one. You just, so I would, like, for example, you could use your two mm. if you're not inclined to have anything else for that two. So can you put free food in the supply then, please? Free food. Just found all of that right now. Let me just check they were all food ones. Yeah, they were. Okay. That's the end of my turn. This goes there. It's Luke's turn, which means Connie gets a crossroads. Are you good? So far. Yes. Okay. For now. For now. <laughs> <laughs> I'll put uh, one food in the supply. Cool, we get another food. Remember to clean it. Yep. But messy, messy. I'm going to clean, but I'm going to use the janitor's ability. I'm going to use my two to get rid of that. Random team. His ability means that he can clean five instead of three. Because he's good at cleaning. This, it's, it's his thing. <laughs> he's like, yes, I knew someday it would pay off. <laughs> <Finally>. <laughs> One of those years at Janet at school. <laughs> um, what else do I want to do? Is it worth me going to the fuel station rather than being... Oh, well, first of all, I'm going to heal. use Olivia's ability to get heal you, sort you out. Thanks. It might you can be wise. Fuel at the station, the police station as well. I'd say it might be worth going there just because there's only two spaces there and there's like zombies. There's already. less zombies. At, yeah, more, yeah, a lot of zombies can come to the gas station. But then I've got to use my fuel to get there. You know what? I'm going to keep her there. Yeah. Because I just don't want to be moving around. Everything okay? 
Yeah, I might just freaked out. Okay, yeah. right. That's fine then. <laughs> yeah, I'll I'll contribute. Actually, you know what? I'll search first if I find any more. Um, can you I... search in the school. Yeah, I use one of my things to search in the school. It's going to have a rummage. Here you are. Thank you very much. Oh, yes, yeah, sick. <laughs> <laughs> Wicked. <laughs> Safe. <laughs> and then... Feeling. It's a bit cold, isn't it? It is. How's the colony? I wish I knew what was going on at the colony, yeah. honestly. I'm just chilling oh, out at school. Yeah. That's holding the fort quite well. <laughs> <laughs> she's psyching herself up. Two yeah. fuel. Hard, she's hard. She likes to cook. Yeah. Dad's just cooking medication bacon and eggs. Dad's got oven bacon and eggs, so she's making out. They've probably yeah. gone off by now. Um, she's probably just making beans a lot. It's like I'm a celeb. She's like, I want <laughs> chickens. Why is no one bringing back any chickens? <laughs> I just keep bringing her back like tins of like pork and like, not pork. Those no those those tins of beans that have the sausages in them. <laughs> and it's like And okay, the hot dog go. ones as well. I'm gonna have a bash at killing one of these. Oh damn. Okay, are you just gonna go for a straight up hit with yeah. who are you fighting with? Annalee. So you roll for exposure if you're not if she doesn't if it doesn't specify a boys. So she has to yeah. risk dying. So does it, is there no other like the combat thing is not going into this one? No, you have to spend a dice Higher or than or the same as the combat ability. Yeah, has. fuck it. Has the two, isn't it? Two, yeah. But I'm gonna spend one of my sixes. So that's, that's fine. fine. Come on, she's just one I care least about. She took a wound. She, yeah, she took a wound. But, but a zombie gets to get taken out. So I'll take that one. Yeah, take basically. Work in reverse order. These entrances aren't a problem until there's three in that entrance. Cool. Yeah. Um, okay. And then, and you know what? I'll use. Annalie has a special ability, doesn't she? She can look at other people's hands. Yeah. I'm going to use Olivia Ooh. Brown to try and clear these two for you. Because she's got the bat. Oh, yeah, she does. So she's going to roll for exposure. Come on, don't, don't die. die. She's got frostbite. That's all she right. She sort that out later. Ne next turn, we'll There's get that sorted. And these two got battered. Off they go. Olivia just runs downstairs with his face. <laughs> <like, "Ow!" laughs> Doctored by day. Arthur and Maria are just chilling out. Like that. What's um, happened to her? Where's she off? Is that all my stuff? Yeah, so you if you've got any away or, or if no, you've got any fuel, would you want to put it in the? I've put two fuel oh, in. <laughs> any fuel. Cool. Connie, so everything's relying on you. It's at the end of this now. Uh, are you done, Luke? Yeah. Do you have any more cards to play, or are nope. you done? Yeah. Cool. So Luke gets a card for Connie. Just a heads up: we know that we're not playing the crossroads in the way they should. It's just to make it easier to yeah. see yeah. what's going on. Right, so first things first, Bev, who does not need to roll for exposure, is going to just straight up murder two of these zombies. Get away from my children! Because <laughs> she hates them. So you are... Do you want to show the card of Bev now. to the Oh, screen. I do, absolutely. There she is, the love of my life. The mother, living her best life, killing zombies. Killing her best, killing, killing her best life. <laughs> killing her best life. <laughs> and who, killing it! who should I... I can't believe I said that on camera. <laughs> I'm going to take <laughs> out... Oh, he's dead for sure now. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Okay. Does so she have to spend a dice at all, or is it just a? How much fuel? Is there a brackets number? Oh yeah, it's plus one. So she has to spend any dice. Cool. That's my four. Cool. So Talia is. Do you want to look at the crisis again? Yeah, she's gonna look at the crisis. She doesn't have to spend anything to do no. that. But she she gets to do it. So she might as well do it every time. Mm. Wait, does it? What does it say in caps here? Does it say anywhere? Anywhere. Okay, cool. Just to check that she's allowed to do it from the gas station. She is. I can see the future. That's so Talia is the future she can see. Shut up. <laughs> That's so Talia. No. Mysterious to me. Yeah. No, I think that's copyright. <laughs> I <sang> it. <laughs> it's a parody. It was that so Talia. Ah, uh, of course. It's fine <laughs> then. It's the other show that we're gonna release. Stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> For our spin off of so, yeah, two go. words. Expiry dates. Oh. Connie's being, Connie's being edgy with these words. I see it I in know. the future. What expiry. Is <laughs> <laughs> food is going <laughs> off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. I'm going to assume it's all food related. Talia yeah. is going to search the gas station. Oh, if we fail this fuel shortage, we lose two morale, by the way. Okay, that's fine. So we need it, otherwise so we lose a lot of morale. Unless that's fine. the traitor wants to mess it up. 
it'd be a good time to. And do you know what? She's gonna just. <laughs> she might as well just search again. Get us some fuel, cool. baby. Okay. We got fuel. We have fuel. Yeah. Yes. It's just the one. Just the one. Oh, Paige, we need so, one more. Yeah, Come Paige, on. Paige, everything's relying on you to get one fuel. But. Okay. <laughs> oh wait! Oh wait! Oh wait! Oh, two fuel. <gasps> Dust fuel. Dust fuel. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So we're right then. We're alright. We're sound then. Was that oh. the end of your turn, Connie? Um, Any more cards to play? I think that's probably it. Yeah, because she sure. can only do that once Pass per round. Pass the crossroads. The end of Luke's turn. Connie's turn. It moves on to Paige. Oh, oh no. Oh. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Oh. No. Nope. Leave it to the golden. <laughs> they wanted, they wanted their tea back. <laughs> <laughs> it's too late now. Okay. Right. Yeah, this happens. It says if the player controls a survivor at the colony and there are two or more, more hope, helpless survivors in the colony. I think there are. There are definitely two more than yes. two survivors. And there's, you have a survivor at the colony, don't you? I do. I have one. The sun shines brightly, reflecting off the beach's perfect white sands and light blue waters. The sunshine state, declares Harold, shaking the postcard in your face. That's where we're headed. Why would we be fighting both the weather and the dead? I think the birds have it right. The wife and I are flying south. Option one, great idea as always, Harold. You open the gates for the old man and his wife. Or option two, who's doing the fighting, Harold? It ain't either of you, so leave and die or stop being an ingrate and shut up. He walks away, but you realise he feels ashamed at having to rely on others. Well, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna tell him to stop being a fucking I, th I think we've, we've got him now, I might as well keep him. Yeah. yeah. Keep him here. Don't so you're gonna tell him not to leave? Yeah. Nothing happened. Ooh. Ooh. Can we know what the other one was? Uh, he would have, you, we would have been able to remove help the survivors from the, the thing. But, but that would have blown up morale, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Right. So, so That's that. A guy was like, let me leave. <laughs> um, yeah. Who was it? Loretta. No Loretta was like, don't let Loretta please let us go. And she was like, no. no. You're not doing well, anything. Sit down and eat your dinner. <laughs> <laughs> eat dinner. She just shoves baked beans um, at me. Yeah. I'm going to... Make um, some more food. Yeah, two food tokens, please, in food supply. Oh, wait, are we running low on food? Yeah. Um, One, two, three, four, five, six. We need two more food. Yeah. Um, We're fine for fuel, though, at least. So. So, yeah, you need to be getting some food. Yeah, so I'm going to have a search where I am. At the hospital? At the hospital. Let's hope. It's probably not food. Is it food? <laughs> food? 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 <laughs> I'd really like some food! <laughs> I, I have an outside of the car. You don't have to play him. Okay. You get to keep that. You can right. decide when you want to play that. Okay. Um, but playing that would be a bit I, like, I'll stressful. I'll heal, heal myself. You have to pay medicine. That's fine. I'll do that. Yeah. Get rid of your wound. And I'll just give that to the... The waste. Oh yeah. Um, to the abyss. Um, <laughs> And then I would like it. <laughs> we need to get food. <laughs> For the last. Show. You can't even search, can you? No. But I can put up a barricade. You're just gonna block yourself in and forget about your problems. <laughs> yeah. You're like the colony this, is starving, this but I'll be This character is most useful at the colony. Um, well, I just thought if you got but, medicine, yeah. and then you could come back, but. But it's fine. Right. Can I move? You can move back if you want. You'll need to roll for exposure. You'll risk rolling for exposure, yeah. Unless you've got fuel. I'll stay there then. I'll yeah, stay there for now. So you'll stay at the hospital. Yeah. Right, that's the end of this turn, is it not? It is. Right, I don't think we paid enough food. We don't, we only have six food. So okay. what happens? So we take all the food out. We add a starvation token into the food supply. I, 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 I might be doing this a bit wrong, this bit, and the rules always get a bit weird about this one. But we always lose one morale if we starve. So I say this, but if we starve again, we lose two morale for the starvation. Okay. So like, is it just, it's not about how little, how much under it you are if you're under it. You it's just, if you don't meet it, you starve. Right, okay. I see. So actually, it might even be beneficial at points when you're like, we're not going to hit the food thing just this thing. Let's it. not bother going for yeah. food this time, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, so now we resolve the crisis. We'll just take the morale thing instead. One fuel, two fuel, three. 
Ooh. Not Ooh. a fuel. And a fuel, so we failed that crisis. Well, it was only me and Connie that put in, so it's Connor. <laughs> Oh, sounds like something oh, the betrayer would it say. Down already. We lose that sounds two like morale. something the betrayer would say. <laughs> <laughs> so we have lost two morale because of our fuel source shortage. Interesting. So things aren't looking are great. We did run out of fuel because someone threw junk in there. Well. Right. I'm well, just saying. We know we're safe. We're, we're good. <laughs> we're good we can say think about who we want to I absolutely know now who the betrayer is. Well, I know as well, clearly. Like, we're just gonna go don't say that. So, <laughs> we'll have, have private to discussions yeah. about this. It's not me. Um, I know it's not me, yeah. so I don't know what question, you're chatting. The question is, do you want to exile the mother who can just keep killing zombies to prevent them from ever... But you might be saying that to guilt us into not kicking yeah. you out. Who or healed you? Who healed you? I cleaned your shit, you I healed your <laughs> wounds, and this is the repayment I'm getting. Who can you put that one in the hospital? Damn right, I can. Can you put this one in the Because I'd do anything for this colony. <laughs> <laughs> gas station. <laughs> is, it still eight oh, gas station. is it still eight zombies? Because was it eight food? Yeah. It was six food, wasn't it? Oh, six food we only had. No, but is it eight food we needed? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I see. Yeah. Two. Oh, shit, we're losing people this round. No, we're not. Aren't we? Four. Yeah, we are. Five. Oh, yeah, we are. <laughs> this might be over. Six. So I'll get back to the corner. So this one overruns. Who has the lowest influence? Brandon's got 26. I'm, 20. Oh, Loretta's going to get eaten. Oh, fuck. <laughs> so Loretta's dead. Loretta's just gone. So we lose a morale for Loretta. Oh god, this could be the We're end. We're on one morale. Uh, so Loretta's dead, RIP. Now we have We've a choice. We've got no cook. I'll just check. And there are too many mouths to feed. Paige, you have a choice, I think. When a survivor is killed, each time a bite effect spreads. Oh, wait, okay, so now who does it spread to? Do I, do I get to who has the next? Is it you? Brandon. Yeah, so Brandon. Look, you have this choice. You have option one. Kill the survivor that the bite effect spread to. The bite effect stops spread it spreading. Or roll the exposure die again. On a blank result, you don't die. Uh, the, the survivor that the bite effect spread to is not killed and the bite effect stops spreading. Or on any other result, he will die. So basically, well, if the I, bite effect spreads. Well, if he dies, we go down to zero, don't we? So basically, you have I to have roll, to roll exposure die. Yeah. And we have to get a blank. Or we're dead. Okay. So this is the end. This of may life. be the end of the game. <laughs> okay, Brandon died. <laughs> and so did the colony. Ah! <laughs> and the colony. So we're all very, very sad. That Aww. game ended in two a round. We had one round and then the second one and we all died. So that's the harshness of this game. A good game. Right, now we all have to reveal our objectives. <laughs> so who was it? Oh, me and Connor? It was you. That's clearly me. Yeah. <laughs> I healed your wounds, so did you and this win? is the thanks I get. <laughs> I did not succeed though, so even though I fucked you all over, I still didn't win. Wait, because... did I succeed? Are there more 12, are there, are there 12 survivors? Not. Probably. You did, you like got a half win because we all did die, but you still got what you wanted. Yeah, I got, yeah. the people are still alive. I didn't get mine, I had to get two guns I mean, everyone's equipped. dead, but people are still So mine was, I need to have at least six cards in my hand. Six oh no, at least, at least six food in my so hand. So you'd have to start I had, hoarding. So I had yeah. to start hoarding food, which I was doing a bit, so I had to, uh, I was, I was holding back on the oh scrap. Oh my god, yeah, you did <laughs> you starve us, <laughs> you're awful, I hate you. Can't right. believe this. That's that. So that was dead win? Dead of winter. Winter. Didn't last very long, but that no. was the dead of winter and we, we died. We made it to the end of like November. <laughs> <laughs> that was the... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we made it through. That was the shittest game of dead winter. Right. I literally had one Thanks for watching everyone. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> what? The plug. Oh, thank you, Boardsock, for supplying us with the game. If you want to play this game, Boardsock do their things on every Wednesday. Wednesday hey, Wednesday, Saturday, we'll have stuff in the links. So Yeah, yeah so just have a look in the description for more stuff about Boardsock. This is a great game, theoretically. Would recommend it, nice. <laughs> we got to play more of it. <laughs> nice. Right, bye. Bye. bye.